Hi everyone, it's Joe Askins with YoChicago.com. I have just gotten off the red line at Roosevelt. I have walked up out from underground, out from the subway, and I'm standing near the intersection of Roosevelt and State Street here in the South Loop. Uh, today I'm riding the red line north from Sox and 35th. I've already made a stop at Cermak Chinatown. This is my next stop. This is Roosevelt. It's about a, uh, I timed it, it's about a three minute ride from Chinatown up here to this stop. Came up, came out, gotta take a look around the neighborhood just real quick. While the train's over here, I wanna pan over, this is the elevated line that runs over Roosevelt Road. You can actually uh, connect from the red line onto either the trains that run on the L here, the orange line and the green line, but you actually do have to come up out of the subway and walk on up to make that transfer. You can also transfer to seven CTA buses, and if you go east, you can uh, get to the Metro Electric and the South Shore Lines at uh, Museum Campus and 11th Street. So the Roosevelt subway station opened in 1943 and CTA updated it in 1996. Uh, it's handicap accessible. There are bicycle facilities down there. If you're biking, you can store your bike. It serves uh, 936,000 passengers, or at least it did back in 2009. Uh, you can't see it from here, but uh, behind me to the west is a Target at Roosevelt and Clark. Uh, you have the Roosevelt Collection, which has a uh, Carasotti's movie theater. The next stop is going to be at Harrison, 608 South State Street. Uh, I'm going to have to go back down underground uh, and ride the subway. The subway travels uh, from here all the way up through the loop, through River North and through the near north side before coming back up above ground and onto elevated tracks in Lincoln Park and stays that way basically from Lincoln Park all the way up to Rogers Park.